Hi Pisces, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your weekly reading for April 1st through the 8th. This is for the sign of Pisces. Recognition and reward. Appreciation. Being recognized for the work that you do, perhaps. Renewed hope. Inspiration. There's some sort of renewal here. And, that you, and I feel like you guys are being protected in some way. A lot of growth. This is the Empress. We have the Six of Cups, the Magician. For many of you, you know, there could be renewed hope with someone from your past. This is the Six of Cups, renewed hope. This is new growth. This is also a rebirth. This is a new awareness. Okay, shedding your old ways, letting go of your old habits, using the powers within you to overcome. Success, there's a lot of success here. Being recognized for all the hard work that you do. You guys are manifesting something new. There could be some sort of, you know, there is a renewed hope, you know, perhaps with someone from your past. That could lead to a lot of happiness, okay? There is a happiness here. This is the Sun card. This is the Star card. This is the Empress card. This is the Magician card. There's divine guidance here. You guys are being divinely guided, okay? And you're being rewarded for the work that you've done. This is something you've manifested. You have manifested some sort of reward, okay? And it has to do, I mean, there could be somebody returning to your life from your past. This could be from your childhood. Somebody, you know, from a past life. Or it could even be a past lover. There is some sort of um, rebirth here. Communication could be coming in. Or you could be communicating with somebody from your past. Um... There is some sort of celebration. You may reconnect with this person from your past. If you get invited to some sort of event, I suggest you go. Um, there is definitely a lot of growth here, okay? And it feels like your prayers have been answered, Pisces. Whatever this is, you know, 333, three, three, your prayers have been heard, okay? Threes are the number of the Ascended Masters, and they are above, and they hear you. Your prayers have been heard here, and your lack of hope, I mean, not your lack of hope, your strength of hope, but not lack, your, I can't think of the other word, you know, your ability to have hope, your ability to, um, God damn it, my mind has gone blank. Don't you hate it with that, when that happens? Anyway, your ability to... Be positive. Your positive mindedness, your law of attraction capabilities, that kind of thing. You are attracting happiness into your life. You have grown. Your awareness. You are highly aware of your thoughts at this time. You are manifesting changes. Your thoughts become things. There's a lot of law of attraction here, for lack of better words, because my mind has gone blank. But I feel as though your prayers have been heard in regards to something from your past. Now, this could be, you know, a, a renewed hope, a renewed inspiration. It's a time of enlightenment, happiness, bliss. You could be receiving communication or communicating with somebody after a period of um, rebuilding, of growth. I feel like you guys have shed some of your old ways. And you have become some become a new person, okay? Because this is rebirth. This is renewal. I And this is renewal, too. There's been a period of healing here, a lot of healing. You guys have went through a huge period of healing. And it, and it appears that there's a, there's a lot, there's a renewed appreciation for your, for you. Okay, 
I do apologize for that. I want to get this zoomed in. It is zoomed in. Anyway. This is as above, so below. So many of you have used the, your resources to prevail. Okay? And now there is some sort of renewal here perhaps with somebody from your past that you either receive communication from or you communicate with or you meet up with them you could cross them on the street or, or meet up with them at some sort of event and it brings about some sort of togetherness okay because here we have the three of wands this is something you have been waiting for it's like your ships are finally coming in Okay, you've been really patient, you've been working hard on yourself, you've been working hard on self-love during this time and, and growing into who you need to be and who you want to be. Um, threes are about growth, they're also about um, divine guidance, they're about mind, body, and spirit union. Many of you have removed the aspects of yourself that no longer serve you. And you've done a lot of healing and with this healing comes rebirth and that's what I see it's like there's some of you are are feeling like there's unconditional love here perhaps you have come to the conclusion that you have unconditional love to offer or somebody is offering you unconditional love Okay, because this is unconditional love right here. This could also be self-love. I feel as though, you know, there is some sort of new hope in regards to someone from your past in which If this is something you you have been praying for I think this is a prayers have been answered I really do and I think that there has been some sort of increased appreciation for someone through healing okay there's been a period of healing that has allowed someone to increase appreciation for another person and now there is renewed inspiration that could lead to some sort of commitment okay because this is a commitment or marriage even okay I feel like there is some sort of I think there is somebody from your past now this can be a past life okay this is the basis of the reading it is the middle card okay so what has happened is is this is the past there there has been some sort of Relearning old skills or learning new skills and letting go of old habits to become reborn again into a new person And it feels as though these changes that have gone on is leading to wish fulfillment here. I see a lot of happiness. And it's something you've earned. You've worked hard on yourself to release old habits, to use your powers within to be successful anyway there's a lot of happiness here coming in this week Pisces and I think that you will be recognized for all the work that you have done on yourself perhaps by some with by somebody from your past You have Aquarius, you have Taurus, you have Leo, you have Gemini.
Either way, this could be the answer to your prayers. The answer to your prayers could come in this week because you've manifested it. Your time of independence was not in vain. There was growth. Anyway, this is what I have, Pisces. Talk to you later. Sorry that was confusing. My mind went blank. <laughs> I'm human. <laughs>